It's always a spectacular show in Philip Island in Manor GP. It's always a spectacular show when Mark Marquez is at the front. Mark, huge congratulations. A, a phenomenal victory here in Australia, a track we know you love. But talk us through that start, the, the tear off. I mean, it was all, almost over before you'd even uh, dropped the clutch. Incredible. Yeah, you know, in the, in the end, was uh, was my fault because uh, it's not a rule, but uh, with, the, with the riders always we speak to try to avoid to remove the tear off on the grid. All for you and, uh, and also for the for the others, but uh, this time, honestly speaking, I didn't have choice because, uh, as we know here in Australia, the insects are super big, some of them. And uh, and I was when I was putting the front device, uh, the whole shot, uh, one big insect was in the screen and was like a film, you know. And then I was uh, looking the 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 lights and uh, I cannot see clear. And I say I will arrive on the first corner and I will not have time. So uh, I decided to remove because I say with with the win, go away, but goes to my rear wheel. <laughs> On that moment, I didn't realize a lot. I saw that we're there, but I say, wow, super unlucky. I mean, I cannot be like this, but, uh, but yeah, it was like this. Mark, I've been here nearly 30 years. I've never seen anything quite like that. Of course, I think you dropped back to 13th in the first corner. Two corners later, you were six. An amazing recovery in there. And then what a fight, firstly with Peko and Jorge, uh, then with Jorge. Just talk about your, your tactics and your strategy. You look very, very strong throughout the race in turn four, and that's obviously where you decide to make the move. Yeah, I mean, uh, uh, when I was 13 on the first corner, uh, I don't know, I was on the end of the straight, and I saw Marini, uh, some Yamaha here. I say, I'm far, I'm far. <laughs> I don't know where I am, but I'm far. <laughs> And, uh, and then in two corners, uh, I went uh, again in a good uh, in a good place. Then I, I decided to, because here you need to manage the tire, but I decided to use all the tire, say, let's see what we can do. And, uh, and I used a lot of the tire on the first, on the first uh, laps to, to have that come back, to, to try to catch, uh, especially Peco, second was my target, because Martin, uh, we had a very similar pace, and, uh, but I didn't have more to catch him. So, uh, so yeah, when I saw that Martin also was there, uh, then, uh, I start to realize uh, about the victory, and, uh, and yeah, in the last laps, uh, I was there uh, just trying to manage uh, everything, the energy, all these things, and, uh, and yeah, on the last uh, last laps, uh, I tried to attack uh, and uh, went well. And just finally, Mark, of course, it's been quite a long time since you've had a, a victory quite like this. Aragon, you were at the front on your own, controlling the race. Mizano, a special situation with the, the flag to flag. This was a old style, proper big old battle, uh, which Mark Marquez was involved in. I'm sure you really enjoyed that, especially at a track like Phillip Island. Yeah, this one was old style. You know, this kind of circuit, uh, when you have a lot of stop and goes with the aerodynamics we have now, you cannot do this kind of races. But uh, in here in Phillip Island, that you don't have a heartbreak point. You can uh, follow the others in a in a good uh, way, and uh, this is one of my strong points in the in the riding style. And, uh, and yeah, in fact, uh, when I was behind Martin, I was super comfortable. I was riding in a in an easy way, we can say, not easy, but uh, I was smooth and, uh, and yeah, managing always the, the distance and. Uh, and waiting until until that last lap. Mark, another awesome job. Congratulations, fantastic Thank victory you. here in Australia. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you.